Okay, and here's the final one I'm going to be talking about in the Bob Mackie collection. I do plan on getting more eventually. I want to get, like, all of them, but for right now, I just have four, and this one is Neptune Fantasy. So, Neptune Fantasy was made in 1992, and she's gorgeous. So I think that she's probably the, one of the most well-known, at least to me. I knew about this doll before I knew about any of the other ones. Like, if I would have seen this, I would have been like, oh yeah, that's one of those Bob Maggie ones, right? Like, I just saw it in lots of books and magazines and illustrations, and it's very iconic, I would think. I mean, at least if you're a Barbie collector, I feel like everybody's seen it at least once. So you've probably heard, or you might have heard, collectors talk about the Bob Mackie face, the Mackie sculpt. This is, to my knowledge, the first doll to have that. Uh, Bob Mackie said that he didn't like her smile. He said it was a little too goofy. I kind of disagree, but he ended up making a face with a closed mouth. Can y'all shut up? My dog and cat are, like, going crazy. Anyway... He decided that uh, she he wanted a more, like, supermodel look and had her mouth closed, which, I don't know. I think it's kind of boring. Anyway, she has this green eyeshadow and, like, little pink dots put in the corner of her eyes. This really pretty lipstick color. She's got this green swirl in her hair with green gl glistening jewels uh, beaded in and sewn everywhere. These beautiful little earrings and... Well, let's just talk about this big plume that's shooting out right here. It wraps all the way around, and it's so, she's so pretty. I love this little see-through mesh bit right here, and then they did not spare on sequins and beads, I can tell you that. It goes all the way around. No ring on this girl, so she's got one arm that sticks out like this to make that go out, but then the other arm is kind of like the My First Barbie arm that looks like a like a swimming paddle, like she's trying to dig something. And so she has no ring on that hand, which is kind of a bummer. And uh, green velvet right here. Now I know for a fact that if you store this doll by a window, this turns orange. The sun will damage it, so you need to keep that away from a window if possible. She's got green shoes to match, and then beading and sequins pretty much everywhere you look, all down there. Oh, I really think that she's very, very pretty. Here's more of a back view. Stunning.